welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be another spend a productive day with me. I've got so much to do but I've just got ready. I was actually going to do a makeup and then I thought I'm not only because me and Chloe might go to the gym later and it's 11 o'clock it is a bit late but I was actually up till 2 in the morning editing my Prague vlog which went up last week. But yeah let's get to the video. Let's get productive. So this is the outfit I'm wearing. I go for comfy over literally anything. As you all will know I pretty much my job is 99.5 percent of the time so i've got my car hat jumper on and then i've just got my motel rocks joggers for like wide leg but yeah i've got some ice water drink water is so important i've made that one of my goals is to drink lots and lots of water i found that not drinking enough water really breaks me out i'm quite lucky with my skin but what does make me have bad skin is not drinking enough water and my hormones like my hormones literally break me out i'm trying to drink one and a half liters i know two liters this is a goal but I went from drinking like less than a litre to one and a half. I would normally wake up and just get a coffee straight away. However, I'm kind of like telling myself that in the morning I'm going to get up and at least have one of these before I go for a coffee. I'm just trying to look after myself. Now I'm going to take all my vitamins. I know you're probably thinking why are you taking so many vitamins. I have my reasons but this isn't really a vitamin. It's just a cranberry extract which just completely like gets rid of any sort of UTI that's on its way. And then I also take vitamin D only because I actually just know I don't get enough. Then I just take my folic acid. I am quite low on it so. And then I take my vitamin C which is like a chewable tablet. Um, I hate the taste of this but especially in winter I'll always take vitamin C because if I don't I end up getting so ill I am so excited to try the mango greens that everyone has been trying. So she kindly sent me them. I haven't actually got them yet because I sent them to my home address because if I send anything to my flat here, if I'm not in, then they'll just take it away. And it's just this awful cycle of your parcel going back and forth from the post office. So I find it easier just to go home. And then when I go home, I can just collect it all. Harrison can bring it down. <laughs> Better than my white ice mock from Starbucks. I love it. Oh, it's so good. But you can literally see it's green. I'm not normally a cafe no type of girl, but as soon as I tried this, but I've got quite a lot to do, so I'm gonna start off with I've got questions to change for a research proposal that I'm doing because we had feedback, so I'm gonna change my questions on that. The questions that I was asking in my study didn't match with my overall question. I've got a couple of things I wanna do. I'm gonna write a to do list. guys i'm back home and the reason why i didn't film even more in the coffee shop was my battery actually died which is really bizarre because i charged it for the whole night last night don't know what's happening there anyway so i've been in the coffee shop from 11 till 2 it's now three o'clock because i've been charging my camera but i actually got a lot done like more than i thought i changed my questions for my research proposal i did lots of my essay and then i came back have been editing my Prague vlog. So it is Wednesday, normally would have got up yesterday. But honestly, I got back on Sunday night at like two in the morning. I didn't take my laptop with me, so I couldn't even edit it whilst I was there. And also I feel like I just wanted to enjoy the weekend um, and I just haven't had time. But I'm transferring it off my laptop now to do the finishing touches on Final Cut Pro on my iPad. I'm like really, really trying to get it up for tonight. But whilst I was in Prague actually, mind my toothbrush, like this is so messy. Um, I went to Sephora, so I thought I'd show you what I got. So for myself, I got myself the Olaplex Shampoo and Conditioner number five and four. They were like the mini 100 ones, obviously, because it only had hand luggage, but I never tried Olaplex hair products except for the bonding oil that I have and I love that so I'm so excited to try these. And then I just got this Pixie Hydrating Mist. I still had notes 
um, check money so I needed to use it in duty free and there wasn't actually a big selection it's like a hyaluronic acid mist and I don't know I haven't tried it yet though but I'm hoping I like it and then I got given loads of freebies so I got this mask which I'm giving to Alfie it's just a vitamin C face mask but it's like the Sephora own brand I got this Clarins I don't even know what it is it's some sort of cream I literally doesn't even say what it is on it then I got the hydrating drunk elephant serum which i've already got the full version of and it's a little mini and alfie really wants to try it so i'm going to give that to him as well and then i've got this pixie glow tonic toner which i'm unsure whether to try it or give it to alfie because i do have quite a few toners already and then i got harrison this postcard i'm going to write him a little letter on it which is quite cute and i also got this postcard for myself i'm going to stick it on my wall now because i got this one from london ages ago and i have never really done anything with it it's kind of just sat here so on my way back from cafe nero i just nipped into co-op and got some blue tap so yeah that's why i got some to for it where is the blue i'm gonna put it on this one i'm not gonna if i had loads i'll put it on that one but i'm not gonna get that many but i said i'm gonna start collecting posters from everywhere i go i feel like next year i'll have quite a collection Slay. Oh, I like that. Now I need to get more. All right, got my new trainers. I've worn them literally once, but I know I should have black socks with them, but I don't have any. They're all back in Leeds. Oh, they've got holes in. I know in the bin. I can't get this shoe on. My V shorts are Primark. They're so good. Primark shorts. My my trainers with these ugly white socks. And then Gymshark. Anyway, we're gonna go to the gym, but we haven't got a spin class booked because there wasn't no. any wasn't any spin classes. They were all booked up because everyone's on their January grind. We're just gonna make it up. We don't really go to the actual no. gym very often. Yeah. Feeling ready, where's my water bottle? Have we got water? Oh yeah. Got my Lululemon water bottle. Favourite thing ever. I'm gonna drive and then after we need to go to the shop. So I'm back from the gym. I'm actually really, really happy I went. It's nearly five o'clock and I need to get this video up for at least six or seven. So I'm gonna spend the next hour finishing that off and literally smashing it out, getting it uploaded. But I got this from Aldi. I'm gonna make a load of nachos. I've got tortilla chips. I have mints in the freezer. I've got sour cream and chili cheese dip. So we have some guacamole left over and then I've got some jalapeno. I've finally finished the video, thank God. And it's six o'clock, so I get it up for seven. So we're gonna make food. I'm actually really happy. I think I've actually got, we've done quite a lot. But look at this mint, it looks good. I wrapped it up in tin foil and I just forgot that it was in my freezer. But I'm gonna cook that now. I'm gonna get Chloe to watch the video and just check it's okay. Can you cook your mix? the last part of the video i know this is a productive vlog but i believe if you have a productive day and you're super busy i feel like you should reward yourself with almost like a mini self-care night time to relax time to chill out time for your brain to just kind of switch off a little bit i'm gonna wash my face let me just grab i don't want to knock the camera i'm gonna wash my face with a sovi face wash i love this someone asked for my skincare routine as well so this is gonna be my nighttime skincare routine i do have a different morning one but i'm gonna actually pop a face mask on so i'm gonna use this ordinary one. Oh, i don't think i've ever opened it i swear i've used this before why did i think it was gonna be white this is crazy actually i'm a bit gobsmacked anyway i put myself down for not doing enough like i did actually wake up a lot later than i wanted to like i wanted to fully get ready do my makeup but i feel like you don't know what you're gonna do till you actually wake up i was just so tired at nine so i actually did actually go back to sleep at 10. I 
at 35 I'm gonna come back and we're gonna wash it off and we're gonna continue with the rest of the skincare routine. It's been 10 minutes. You know you can't smile. You know a face mask is good when you can't do that. I don't like the way this is coming off at all. Do you see that? That wasn't the best. Anyway, moving on. Favourite nighttime toner. It's cheap. Bioma is very reasonably priced, especially by the amount you get for brightening toner. And it says it's meant for nighttime, so that's when I use it. But I just feel like I don't get red anymore since I've been using this and the Glow Recipe one. But I started using this slightly before. But the Glow Recipe one I use in the morning. I've been just going with the Ordinary Hyaluronic Acid. I 100% will always love this. I have repurchased, I think, three times now. I know I showed you the Pixie. It's like a milky mist and it's got a hyaluronic acid in it so i feel like i'm gonna try this tonight and just leave the ordinary one just to see how this goes oh, that is a good spray i actually prefer that spray to the glow recipe spray i then use my bioma hydrating serum on a night i actually love this i'm not gonna lie i, I have the drink elephant one it's very very pricey but i feel like this I don't know, it makes me even look more hydrated. Um, but the only bad thing about this is the syringe isn't very good. Like it feels like it's empty, but it's not. Like it's it's new, but it, it kind of feels like it's empty. I just use about that much. And then I'll either use this moisturizer or my CeraVe moisturizer. I do normally use my CeraVe moisturizer only because it's a bit more watery and I do kind of prefer that in a moisturizer. This is a little bit more thick. I kind of switch around with what moisturizers I use. And then I always use this on a night. It's my lip mask, my Laneige one. It's in the berry fruits flavor. Let's just say I got this honestly about a year ago. You don't need a lot and I'm really impressed with how long it lasts. So I'm going to end the video here. I am so grateful for you all. You know that. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.